Lesson 5, Storage Devices. By the end of this lesson, you should state and describe storage devices. In Lesson 4, we discussed input and output devices. In this lesson, we will discuss storage devices and media. Remember, in previous lessons, we mentioned the random access memory or the RAM. The RAM is a storage media which is known as primary memory and it is temporary. It is mainly used by the CPU while the computer is on. When the computer is switched off and on again, the memory is empty. Apart from primary memory, the computer system also uses the secondary memory, which stores programs, information, and data on a permanent basis. This type of memory is used to store the operating system, installed applications, data, and information. Let's discuss storage devices and media that represent secondary storage. We need to understand that storage devices are devices that store and access data or information on a storage media, while storage media are materials that are used to store information or data. A compact disk or CD player which can store and read data on a compact disk or CD is a good example of a storage device, while a compact disk or CD is an example of a storage medium. All storage devices work with media. We can now discuss storage media in details, solid state media. This is storage media that store data electronically. They usually have no moving parts. A flash drive and an SD card are good examples of such media. Magnetic media. This type of media store data in patterns on a magnetized medium. These have moving parts and a good example is a hard drive. Optical media. Store data or information by burning patterns on a special plastic disc through laser technology. Digital versatile discs, DVDs, and compact discs, CDs, are good examples of this type of media. After discussing storage devices and media, we cannot forget to discuss storage capacity. This refers to the amount of information a storage device can store. Just like containers of water or other liquids have different capacities measured in milliliters or liters, storage media also have various capacities measured in bits, bytes, kilobytes, and so on. A bit is a binary digit, which is 0 or 1, while a byte is equivalent to 8 bits. 1024 bytes amount to 1 kilobyte, and 1024 kilobytes make 1 megabyte. A gigabyte is made up of 1024 megabytes, while 1024 gigabytes are equivalent to 1 terabyte. All computers come with internal storage. An internal hard drive has read and write heads that move over a magnetic disk or platter. Read heads read information on a disk while write heads write information on the disk. Reading is retrieving information while writing is storing it. In most cases, the storage capacity of an internal hard drive is measured in gigabytes and terabytes. For most desktops, 
hard drive capacity ranges from 350 gigabytes to 4 terabytes and more, while in laptops, the capacity ranges from 500 gigabytes to 2 terabytes. An external storage media is in most cases portable. This means that you can carry it around. It is used to store information and transfer information from one computer to another. You can also use external storage to back up the information on the computer to avoid losing data when the computer crashes or if it is stolen. The most common external storage media are external hard drives, flash drives, optical media, and memory cards. You should also note that there is cloud storage, which is also a form of external storage. Examples of cloud storage are Microsoft OneDrive and Google Drive. Most external storage media are connected to the computer through universal serial bus or USB ports. Revision exercise. A. Make a list of at least six storage media and four storage devices. B. Describe the type of each storage media and device you stated in A. C. What do you understand by the following? 1. Bit 2. Byte 3. Kilobyte 4. Megabyte 5. Gigabyte and 6. Terabytes. Summary. In this lesson, you learned about different types of storage devices and media. These are internal, external, and cloud storage. You also learned that storage capacity is measured in bits, bytes, kilobytes, megabytes, gigabytes, and terabytes.